what I want to do right now is go to geogebra.com or .org slash geometry. And in this video, I'm going to reflect a figure across the X or the Y axis. First, I'm going to go to the settings and show axis. Then I'm going to go to Show Grid and click on Major Grid Lines. Now I'm going to create a polygon. I'll create something that looks like this. This is a random polygon. I just made it up. I'm going to change it to gray. Now, what I want to do is click on More and scroll down to Transform. I have Translate, Rotate, and Reflect. I am going to reflect about a line. This also means reflect across a line. So if I were to click this down here, it says Select Object to Reflect, then Line of Reflection. So first, I go over here and I select the object that I want to reflect. I want to reflect polygon A, B, C, D. Now I have two options. I can reflect over the Y axis, or I can reflect over the X axis. First, I'll show you what the X axis looks like. So again, I click this, I reflect, I click this object, now I'm going to reflect about this line. Notice how this just reflected over the x-axis. I'm going to do this one more time, but I'm going to reflect this polygon over the y-axis right here. Notice how after my first reflection I have A prime B prime, C prime, D prime. Well, now I have A double prime, B double prime, C double prime, and D double prime. That is how to reflect across one of the axes using this website.